Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everyone. I hope you all must be doing good. So today I got Redmi Note 11 and uh, the Android 12, MIUI 13.0.4. Having Android 12 version is already released for Redmi Note 11, but still we are not getting uh, any OTA update for this device. It will come, but it will take a time. So those who have an unlock bootloader they can simply download the rom and flash and today i am going to show for those who have an unlock bootloader of redmi note 11 they can simply follow my flashing steps tutorial steps and get the miui 13.0.4 and white version 12 on your redmi note 11 so before going ahead do not forget to subscribe my channel click the bell icon and select on thank you so much for doing that so moving ahead i have provided a video link tutorial video link in my video description how to unlock a bootloader of any xiaomi mobile phones if you do not know how to unlock the bootloader you can simply watch that video let me show that my set is updated on the last and latest miui version 13.0.15 having android version 11 but the, but one thing more that my device is non-NFC. The steps are same, but use the ROM which is released for NFC Redmi Note 11. This one is not NFC. This is non-NFC device. You have to save all the data. Internal storage, this, this procedure will format everything. Mobile battery must be charged to maximum like uh, 70 to 80 percent. Then going to settings and uh, about phone tapping the miui version for seven times one two three four five six seven developer mode is done on then go back go to additional settings here i would like to show something we are tap the developer options and the me unlock status this is what you must see the device is unlock so you can flash the invite 12 on your mobile phone in case if you are using me account sync your me account once remove it must then go back to account sync sync your google account to once and remove and one more thing go to password security turn off the lock screen password that's all what you need to do before proceeding the flashing method after doing all these things you can simply power off the mobile phone coming back towards my computer screen because this procedure requires data cable and computer so this is the website where i am going to download the roms for redmi note 11 so the link is uh, provided in my video description you can simply click the link and this website will get open come to this uh, section then click on device and write or type your mobile uh, the model number i if you can if you want if you know the code name you can simply type the code like my redmi note 11 is having spes code name if i uh, if i type spes the redmi note 11 will come and if you don't know the set code name then simply type redmi note 11 so this is the non nfc device and this one is spes n n means nfc i will go for redmi note 11 non nfc device spes click here and click download the other website will get open and here we will see a bunch of roms for redmi note 11 now you can see that nfc roms are also available on this website which was not supposed to show here but do not go for nfc if your set is not nfc just come here and you will see redmi note 11 global and we will go for the fast boot red is uh, look for the redmi note 11 global stable fast boot and 13.0.4 now in case if you are watching this video in future doesn't matter if this version is not same if you see 13.0.6 or 7 or 8 just go for it but you must see the the uh, alphabets like uh, starting from s g this one is android version 11 r but the s starting the s means that the version must be 12 yes here you can see that the above, above, above 
the above one is Android version 11 which is starting from R and this version this one is Android version 12 and the file size is 5.8 GB now click on the download here the other website will get open come down and do not go for the recovery you will see two section here one is redmi note 11 global the recovery file and the above one is fast boot for a uh, fast boot file yes redmi note 11 sgsc fast boot click on full rom the uh, rom file will start downloading i have already downloaded that is why my idm is showing that you have already downloaded this rom okay i will go back to my uh, downloaded folder now okay here we go i have already downloaded the rom file this one and uh, me flash in case if you haven't installed any drivers of xiaomi on your windows i will suggest you to download me flash tool 2017 the particular version and then extract it on same folder and after extracting open the extracted folder and double click this file and let install it on your windows so what will do this file this uh, software when we boot the set into fast boot mode connecting it with windows the drivers will get installed automatically this file is just for the drivers now come back to the downloaded folder and extract the rom file in same folder Finally, the uh, file extract got finished and now open the extracted folder. Now, before uh, doing this, I would like to inform that I this is my PC and this is my hard drive and I am in subfolder where my ROM files are saved. Now, open the extracted ROM folder, double click on it. You will see another folder inside, double click this one this folder you will definitely see a bunch of flashing files in this second folder now go back and press f2 select this folder press f2 then come to this side at the end of the global click on it and uh, press the backspace of keyboard and make this file name short come to the bring to the, bring the cursor to m and then click enter must rename must make the name short and when you have done this uh, thing simply uh, copy this particular folder which is having all the flashing bunch of files copy this folder from here if you want to copy or if you want to cut i will do cut and then go back to the main hard drive partition do not paste that particular folder in subfolder currently i am also uh, in in my subfolder so i will go for my main hard drive partition kingston ssd i will click on it i have came out from the subfolder and i will simply paste that folder on my main hard drive partition just check this pc and main hard drive partition now if i click double click on this uh, folder we we will see all the files must do this step to get avoid any issue now coming back towards my mobile phone we need to boot the set into fast boot mode for that hold the cable in your right hand and the mobile phone must be power off simply press and hold the volume down key then connect the cable must check the other side of this cable connected to the computer when you connect the cable in few seconds the set will boot into fast boot mode release the volume down key immediately you will see orange color fast boot screen on your mobile phone right my set is connected to my computer and booted into fast boot mode now i will go to my device manager just to make sure that the drivers got already installed or not yes android phone android bootloader interface which means that now the flashing will start and will be done perfectly without any issue now here the most important part 
If you want to relock the bootloader, then I will suggest you to double click the flash all file, flash all lock. If you want to relock the bootloader while flashing, then the bootloader must get relock, then double click flash all lock file. But for those like me, I do not want to relock the bootloader. I want my set bootloader to be remain unlocked. And also, I want the Android version 12 MIUI 13.0.4 ROM on my mobile phone. So for those, I uh, must go for the flash all file. Double click the flash all file and the black color window, command window will get open and the flashing procedure will get start. Now you have to wait. This flashing procedure will take time, maybe around uh, 10 minutes. Just wait for it. Let the flashing complete. Then we will continue. Okay, flushing is almost to be done. And after flushing, the black color command window will get closed automatically. The set will restart automatically and will definitely start booting to the stock ROM and white version 12. Finally, flushing done, set got auto restart. The command window get closed automatically. We are done from the computer. Thank you, computer. And just wait to start the first boot. And this is the first boot, which may takes around one or two minutes. Now you can disconnect the cable from mobile phone. And white version 12, MIUI 13. The first boot took only one minute, less than a minute and uh, setup screen or welcome screen appears. Complete the setup screen now. Finally, we got Android version 12 on Redmi Note 11. You can see that the control center is got change and this is the notification center. And we got, if I go further in my mobile phone settings and if I tap about phone, the set is got updated from Android version 11, MIUI 13.0.15 to Android version 12, the global MIUI 13.0.4. If I go further on tapping on all specs, uh, specs, the specification, 4GB plus 2GB octa-core Android version 12, MIUI version must check the baseband. The numbers must be seen uh, below baseband version, which means that the network will work absolutely perfect that is how we can update or we can get the miui 13.0.4 android version 12 on redmi note 11 right so do not forget to like the video keep sharing it with others and those who did not my subscribe my channel yet do not forget to subscribe my channel thanks a lot take a good care of yourself we'll see you in my next video until then goodbye